Hey guys, what's going on? I'm here to bring you a little overview of this uh, Green Lantern Omnibus Volume 2. I haven't seen any videos here on YouTube about it, so I'm gonna give you, you know, that way you guys can see how, you know, how does it look and all that. And I just got this in the mail about five minutes ago, if that. And, and yeah, let's go. So, I've been planning to get this for a long, long time. I've had it on my in-stock trades uh, wish list for a while. But a few months back, I saw it on Barnes & Noble. I go there, you know, to check, you know, the hardcovers and whatnot, to see how they look like in person and whatnot. And then I just get them, you know, elsewhere for a lot cheaper than, you know, paying full retail for it. But I was just like shocked, like when I opened it, you know, it stays open here, but you know, it just, you know, doesn't stay open whatsoever. And I was like, you know what, Instac had it for about $42 or so. And, you know, for me that was like, nah, I'm not paying that much money for a book that, you know, just no way. This one retails for for about uh, seventy five dollars, so that's no way. It's just not as good as the Marvel Omnibus and whatnot. But it's just it's some some binding a little bit there, but you know there's not very much room there to play with when you know you have it open so yeah i got this for 28 dollars with shipping and everything from ebay so i think that's you know that's a pretty good price for it i'm not gonna complain too much about it but if you're gonna pay like the full retail price or like even 42 dollars or so it's just it's just no no way so, you know, here's without the dust jacket, it's just a little lantern there. Here's the back. So yeah, this has, oh, uh, let's see. Uh, issues 22 to 45. Here's some of the, you know, some of the pages. It's just kind of, you know, it just doesn't stay open. Like it's, it's a bit funny and whatnot, but you know, I really don't like, you know, applying too much pressure when I'm reading, you know, hard covers and whatnot. But with this book, kind of like, you know, you have to hold it there in place because. Not even halfway, like it's just doesn't open. It's a bit of a mess. So yeah, but for twenty eight fifty I'm not gonna, you know, complain too much about it. So hopefully I can get volume one for the same price. And the sad thing about it too, it was just, you know, on an auction, so that right there right there tells you like not a whole lot of people wanted it because it was just me and an, and another guy bidding on the book, and twenty eight fifty. Well, <laughs> that was the highest, you know. It was free shipping too, so that right there tells you that you know, not a whole lot of people wanted it, and it's kind of sad. I mean, Green Lantern is one of my favorite DC characters, especially Hal Jordan. So yeah can't wait for you know to start reading this and yeah guys thanks for watching and i'll be doing a little haul video tomorrow so yeah guys thanks